Today we're at Hawksworth in Blue Ash to tell a really important story about how blood donation can truly save lives and a life right here. And we get to talk with Bryn today, but more importantly, we're talking with Lindsay Schulte, her mom. Lindsay, thank you so much for joining us today. Absolutely, it's our pleasure. So Lindsay, why are we here at Hawksworth in Blue Ash today? We are celebrating Bryn's fourth birthday. Yay, it's so exciting. Yes. I come to this donor center and we wanted to pay it forward and say thank you to not only the Hawksworth workers, but people here that are actually donating blood, um, maybe for the first time or the repeat donors. Bryn receives medication daily through her port in her chest um, in order to survive and live a happy, healthy life. And it's through blood donors that we see here today that she's able to do that. Aww. And I think that's such a beautiful thing to come in and say thank you because she is a, a miracle and she is a product of really seeing how the community can come together and support someone. Tell me a little bit more about her treatment and what that looks like, how the blood products really help her live her life. Absolutely, so when Bryn was born, um, she had two near-death bleeds and blood transfusion saved her life in that immediate moment. Thereafter, she was diagnosed with factor 13, a very severe, rare bleeding disorder. And she needs medication, it's called Corifact. It's a human-derived plasma from blood donors. She needs this every other day in order to survive and live. Donating blood has become near and dear to our heart because she is our life and uh, without their help, she wouldn't be here today. So one special way that you all celebrate Bryn's birthday every year is you have a blood drive. Tell me more about that and really what inspired you all to make that happen. After Bryn's diagnosis, we saw the importance of blood donation. So my husband and I actually attended a blood drive at his work, mm -hmm. saw how easy it was, and I wanted to celebrate her birthday in a special way mm -hmm. when she turned one and survived the first year of her life. And we started a tradition, and every year we do a, a mobile blood drive on our street, and it's every July. And what does that mean to you to see people come out to support Bryn and really so many other people that are impacted by this? We didn't get through and we still don't get through her experience um, and her diagnosis and path without family, friends, neighbors, strangers, donors. Um, so it's, it's so meaningful to us to do this and pay it forward and it means the world to us. So we, we're gonna do it every year. Yeah, that's so exciting. So even when she's like 25, we're still gonna be doing it. Yeah, she may not think it's cool, but <laughs> we're gonna do it. Another thing that we've been talking a lot about with Hawksworth, our partner, is just the need that there is for blood donation and blood supply, especially during these summer months when people are traveling and they're out and about, and it might not be top of mind. What's your message to someone who maybe hasn't considered donating before, or maybe they haven't donated in a while? It's easy and it's critical, mm -hmm. um, especially for someone like Bryn. She does not have a choice in the matter mm -hmm. with her diagnosis and her treatment, um, but she does you know, get infused every other day. And if a four-year-old can, can do it, I think anyone can. And giving blood is a gift. It's an act of kindness, and mm -hmm. this is the receiving end of it. How is she doing now? She, I mean, she's four, she's thriving, you've got the bows on. <laughs> you love Minnie Mouse, don't you? Yeah, same yes. girl, same. But yeah, what does her life look like now? What do you do? You like to dance and sing? Mm -hmm. And she goes to school. She's got two older brothers. She lives a normal, happy, healthy four-year-old life. Well, Bryn, thank you for your time. It's been so fun. Mm -hmm. Are you excited about being four? Yeah. Yeah, what are you most excited about? Um, being four. Being four? Oh my <laughs> gosh, girl. <laughs> Brent, what do we want to say? Thank you, um, but don't know. If you'd like to learn more about how to donate, visit hawksworth.org.